Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Also, welcome there. So today we have another Epic Universe construction video from the outside looking in and we're gonna see what we can see that may be new because every day something is changing at Epic Universe. And one day closer to opening, whenever that is. But anyways, let's actually start the thing. So come along with me. All right, now it's time to start a little update here. A little panorama shot. Here is Helio's Grand Hotel. You do see that main dome is all covered up now. It's some kind of like material. Pretty awesome. But also, two smaller domes has actually been added as well. Not sure if it's finished parking lot, but it looks like it. But that's super awesome. Of course, you can see the show building for the Dark Universe attraction. And speaking of Dark Universe, here it is right here. It's pretty awesome. And Dark, um, the manor itself has some scaffolding on it, which is cool. There's more of it. You can see a mill over there has the actual blades as well. It's super awesome. Keep on going. In the middle, kind of, you can see the carousel. It's actually cool. And, of course, you can see um, How to Train Dragon, Isle of Burke fully that's um scalpton is down for it's like pretty cool you can see the portal let's actually go a little bit more to the right you can see another little mill right there that is actually spitfire grill from how to train a dragon super cool i think it's be one of like the uh, quick service locations but that's another cool addition and here is nintendo world and of course um donkey kong country as well can't see anything test at the moment but you can see that barrel pretty good of that's actually what the coaster goes through this is amazing and of course, with the Tender World, there is Mount B Pole inside of there. That looks super awesome. Cannot wait to walk inside of there. And it's a little note parent shot going to the left side. All right, guys, now for our next little update Drive My Terra Luna. It's looking amazing. Basically, the whole front side is basically wrapped with this like, like reflective like tiles. It looks amazing. And here's next view at Stella Nova. This is amazing, as you can see. This is truly awesome. As you can see on the building itself, they look like like little things over like lights. So at nighttime, supposedly it looks like stars on the building. Like it's super awesome. I've seen it once. And here's a closer look into the tiles and also these little pattern lights over here it's going up on the building. That's super cool. And of course you can see on the windows is like these black ceilings. It's actually really awesome. You can all see this trim around the building's actually being covered because actually are doing a painting right now. It's actually super awesome. They're not done yet, but it's almost there. And of course, as you can see in the side right here, this is like the little facility building for the pool and stuff. It's like super cool, has a stair built up. Like, I don't think the last time I was here, I don't think I've seen this stair built up, but super cool to see this. Okay, so now coming to the other side here is actually the front of the hotel. As you can see right here, this is actually a little on and actually like we like a car drop off a uh, uh, uber pickup and stuff that's where that's going to be and here is the actual parking lot super cool looks like the actually off work for today but super cool views like definitely i would choose these room for a park view to see epic universe at nighttime right there that's amazing now with this view you can actually see some more stuff over here this is actually dark universe theater you can actually see the manor right there it's pretty awesome and just a little bit just a little bit probably like right there you can actually see the mill like they call it the burning mill but we're going to call it the mill but yeah it's pretty awesome right here that's the bridge to build and that's the uh, kirkman Road extension it's really awesome and of course you can see helio's grand hotel and with helio you can actually see a good bit on the front of it and of course like right in the middle on that top you have that like celestial kind of like symbol thing that's actually super cool and actually right in front of us actually looking at donkey kong country and of course there is nintendo world uh bowser's challenge right there that's a big building all right guys we have now come to one of my most favorite shots if you're looking at isle of burke this is amazing you do see mead hall fully unscaffold this is amazing you can see star for race in the background of course you can't miss it you do see um the mill from spitfire grill it was pretty cool you do see the flat ride as well that's um Dragon Racers Rally, and of course you can see a little bit of the coaster. Let's see if we can actually get to it. It's a little bit of the track from a uh, hiccup swing gliders, but yeah, this is super impressive.
All right, guys, well, that'll do it today. Another little quick update video on the outside of Epic Universe, looking in, see what we can find. The two biggest things from today is uh, Helios Grand Hotel. Um, the dome is now covered up with something, and also two smaller domes are below it, and that looks really cool. It's like a gold, brownish color, so definitely some progress there. And also, uh, uh, Hydro Dragon Isle Burke, uh, we can see that mill now at Spitfire Grill really cool i'm actually really excited and we're living some really awesome times now you know, epic universe is taking shape day by day and it's always going to be something brand new and if you really want to see some cool stuff on um, check out by rick Shuff on his uh, x page well twitter but you know x he's always having some really cool stuff that uh aerial shots like it's amazing that we said that we cannot see it's inside a park it's awesome and like stuff we can't see like example like socio park like um the Atlantic restaurant, like it looks amazing. So check his a little uh, page out. It's actually really awesome. But anyways, if you did enjoy this video, a big old thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more future content. I will see you guys next one. Thank you so much for watching.